from Star and welcome to my channel, Starlight Starbright 70. If you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. And if you are new, welcome, come on in. So today we've got Timu. We haven't done Timu in a while. At least for me, it feels like forever. <laughs> oh, I am still an affiliate with Timu. Uh, they are putting the influencer program in with Timu. Oh, sorry, in with the uh, affiliate. The influencer program is going into the affiliate program. And that starts July 1st, but I do still have my code. I uh, Please still use it. It does help me out. Um, apparently, we're still going to be getting that seeding money. So, you guys did awesome uh, last month. And we reached our goal. And so... Let's see how we can do for next month. Uh, but I'll put my code up here on the screen for you. Like I said, anyone can use it. Just put it in your search bar. You're going to have a page that comes up. Just ignore it. It's, uh, it's unless you want to join the affiliate program. That's totally up to you. But uh, And then just go shopping how you, how you normally would. Um, on that page are some items that I have personally purchased and that I like. I was able to pick some things out on there, and there's of course some things that have been added, but um, but yeah. So, just wanted to share that with you. Um, if, you're, if you've never used Timu on your app and would like to install it, there's a link in my description for you. <laughs> Go to the link and download it, you'll get 30, if you use that link in my code, you'll get 30% off your first order. Plus, if you haven't had the app on your phone for the more than 15 days, then it works for you too. You get 30% off your order. Um, if you never use Timu at all, then use that link, use the code, you'll get 30% off and a $100 coupon bundle. I do play Farmland and Fishland occasionally when I remember when I have time. <laughs> Takes so long to feed those fish. I go click, 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 click. I want it to be like automatic, but I know it's click, feed, wait, click, feed, wait. Uh, so, but anyway, I do log into those uh, quite a few times a week and do try to play. So, if you're interested, those codes will be in my description as well. So, you can read all about Timu. You can, you can join me in feeding the fish and watering my crops if you'd like. Um, but yeah, Timu has, um, awesome prices and they got diamond paintings and I got some to share with you today. I'm so excited. Uh, the order that I put in, um, quite a while ago, it was for a couple's theme that my husband and I did for anniversary. Well, they still haven't found the package and they said that they're looking into it, but I did get a $5 credit and that's really nice. Um, I got a bunch of price adjustments, so make sure you're checking your price adjustments. And I got my free gift from my Team Moon Circle. And I got something like, okay, so I had a coupon of, what was it, a 30, was it, yeah, $30 off of a $130 order. So basically for $130, all I had to pay is 100 So I put in a big order, and then from that $100, I got back, something like $12 through my Timu Circle. If you don't know what Timu Circle is, it's a thing that Timu has added. It should be on the, if you go to you and you scroll to the top, there should be a thing called Timu Circle. It does cost, um, for me anyway, it was $3.99 a month and I need to review it, renew it for July. But, uh, so right now I have something like $30 or $40 credit um, sitting and waiting to be burned through. It's like, oh yeah, I want this, and I want this, and I want this. <laughs> but yeah, so um, my husband and I also ordered our weird theme. So that it will be coming up. So you guys picked the weird campaign. I wasn't sure what Timu was doing with the influencer program. So my husband and I went ahead and we just said, you know what, we'll, we'll do a weird theme. So that will be on its way. So I'm really looking forward to that. And then we have a... July 1st and 4th uh, celebration to do with you guys so we'll probably do another live uh, the live was really fun I'm so sorry we weren't able to keep up 
<laughs> with the chat oh my goodness it was our very first one so uh yeah we were uh, learning as we were going and uh, I was watching the beginning of it and I thought oh, that was so funny my husband thought that you guys could talk to us too and he's like well I can hear them and I'm like no honey that's us because we still had our volumes on our phone um that was coming through YouTube <laughs> <laughs> so funny but anyway we had lots of fun and we definitely want to do it again so that is something to look forward to for July 1st we'll probably do it on July 1st so watch out for that video like I said we'll probably go live for it and July 1st is Canada Day and then of course July 4th is Independence Day all right so I'm gonna do my shout out today um, her name is Rosenet 39 I believe yes Rosenet 39 she has done 97 videos she um, does a lot of diamond painting from Timu but yeah all her videos have all um, episodes so it's kind of kind of cool to keep track of oh how many videos have I done but that's what her channel looks like right there and her name is Rosenet39. She's Rosie. And I have been subscribed to her for some time. She's got 353 subscribers. So before she hits 100, episode 100, <laughs> that's three episodes away, uh, let's try to get her to close to her 400 subscriber mark. That would be awesome if we could do that. Um, again, Rosenet, I'll have her linked in my description for you. You just need to click on her link. Go over to her channel and hit that subscribe button. Um, if you want, you can leave a comment letting her know that uh, you come from the RV family over here. And that would be wonderful. Um, so she knows. And and yeah, let's go support her. Um, I enjoy watching her when I can. I'm so far behind, guys, on my channels. I am so... I apologize. I've been working really hard on... Um, my little off canvas things to send uh, to the be to a benefit that I'm also involved in in July. Um, so yeah, I've been really busy doing that. Yesterday I got what one, two. I got a bunch of things done yesterday, but I will show all those on another video when I'm all complete, and I'll show you the little bundle I'll be sending off. All right, our love and light. Our love and light today. So we've been doing this Love and Light series, and I got these cards off of Timu for like six bucks or something. If you were to purchase them in the USA, it would have been eighteen ninety nine. Isn't that crazy? And um, I'm not sure where it's published. I think it was. I'm not sure where the publish is. Price varies. It says. Yeah, price really varies because I got it for six bucks. But anyway. Uh, person that created these cards is Doreen Virtue. She does have a YouTube channel and she's really interesting. So I will also have her link in my description. She is just awesome. Um, she was into New Age and then she turned, uh, became a Christian. And um, so she dropped a New Age and so she brought out uh, these set of cards and she talks Christianity of course on her channel. Uh, but anyway, so there was 44 cards in here and it's called Love and Light. And that's our Love and Light series that we've been doing. And here's the card. So we're going to mix them up and we'll see what our message of the day is. I just love uh, reading our message of the day. I hope everyone's having a great day. How are you guys? Alright. I hope you guys are just doing wonderful. <laughs> Let me know. Let me know how you guys are doing. Okay, retreat from the outside world. Hmm, interesting. Retreat from the outside world. And yesterday, the card told us to go outside. <laughs> and today it's saying retreat from the outside world. Maybe that means from the hot. It says the rain and snow come down from the heavens and stay on the ground to water the earth. Isaiah 55, 10. So the rain and snow come down from the heavens. So when it's raining... Uh, when it's snowing, well, it doesn't snow here that much. But anyway, right now in this month, when it's raining, um, yeah, stay, just stay indoors. <laughs> be safe. Basically, it's saying be safe out there. 
And right now with this heat wave, please, please stay out of that heat. So yes, retreat from the outside world. Go indoors where it's nice and cool. Hopefully uh, you guys have air conditioning or you're in a building that has air conditioning. Especially in this heat wave today here, it's going to be 104. So my little air conditioners are going to work overtime. Today I do have my fan going and I do have my one air conditioner going. Because it was warm here already. Eight, I think at like 9 o'clock it, um, it was close to 90 degrees already. So yeah, really, really important to keep indoors, keep safe. There's storms in your areas too, please take heed. Um, I know there's flooding happening too over in the Dakotas. So um, my prayers and thoughts go to those communities that have to evacuate. And they've just had, I guess, lots and lots of rain over there. And uh, just so much happening in this world. But yes, always just be just take heed of the weather that's around you and um, keep safe that's the main thing and that's I believe what that verse is saying is you know what when it's raining or when it's snowing you know it's here for a purpose God does everything for for a purpose uh, nothing happens without one so uh, so yeah uh, just be careful out there <laughs> and just know yes we do have a place where we can come in and get cooled off and so forth. Actually, before I before I start on the diamond paintings, I am going to show you these. So these are just a little pair of flip flop, not really flip flops, but they're just like little sponge shoes. And I just wanted something that I could just you know slip on and go. And I just thought these were so cute. They are purple, and they got a little bear on them. Uh, these ones and the soles are like pretty good pretty good soles. They are kind of a little bit But they're almost like a foam uh, Shoe and I got them for like really cheap. <laughs> I think they were like a buck something but uh, but yeah I thought these were perfect for out here just to be able to slip on when I'm sitting outside with the pups or something and So yeah Really really cute. They'd be really cute little house shoes, too. I think these ones are 40 41 so I presume they're a size of eight seven and a half or eight probably because it says 40 41 so I'm sure I got them in seven and a half but yeah really really cute shoes I like them and they're really light too like they are they're feather light they hardly weigh anything at all so I don't know what they make them out of of course it doesn't say what they're made out of but they do say sport in them so they'd probably be good for the beach too. Something that if you go down to the beach, they'd probably be awesome for that. So, so yeah, I really like them. And they came in this cute little bag too. Really, really cute bag. Sorry, I don't have the prices in front of me uh, today. I just kind of thought, oh, I want to review these today. So I will make sure that all the prices are, um, of course prices change on Timu, they go up and down, but I'll put the current price in my uh, description for you guys. Alright, the first time I'm painting here. This one is a 40 by 40. And what do we got? Ooh, this one's a pretty one. This is such a pretty one. The Christ that comes with your kit here. So just your basic kit. It's got your tray, your wax, and your pen. That's all you really need for diamond painting. I do prefer a bigger tray though. Where is my tray that I've been using? Oh, there it is. Excuse my reach. <laughs> uh, oh, I got wax stuck to the bottom of this. So this is a tray that I prefer using. I do have some purple ones around here too that I come from Centro on, but. <laughs> But anyway, this one has a really nice pouring uh, spout and yeah, it's getting pretty worn down already so I'm probably going to end up having to uh, re just keep using my purple ones because I've used this one for uh, quite so long and it is actually my favorite one that I usually grab first. But the purple ones are really, really good too and I don't have any laying around here on this table at this moment. But anyway, this size tray here is what I do prefer using, uh, rather than these little trays. But if this is all you have, this is all you this is all you need. 
So if you're just trying dime painting out for the first time, I don't suggest you going out and spending lots of money. Get, your, get yourself your first dime painting kit. Um, I suggest maybe a 30 by 30 to start off with. Uh, but if you see something else that you like, yeah, go for it. These are the pretty colors. Oh my. So, so pretty. So this one comes in the chain. And so it's not kitted up already. But look at those colors. Really, really pretty colors. So, yeah, really, really nice. Really nice colors. Oh, I better not put that on there. All right, and this painting here, she is so pretty. I loved her. So just a fairy in dandelions, and I just thought that was just so, so pretty. I love my fairy girls, and saw this one, and just, yeah. Love the flowers in her hair. Like I said, just a whole bunch of that. Oh, to me, they look like dandelions. I'm thinking they're dandelions. And... Um, there are some daisies here on the on the bottom as well, but she was just so pretty. Um, this one has 24 colors, and it is letters and uh, numbers, but they are jumbled jumbled. <laughs> so yeah. And there's your drill fill, really nice clear drill fill there. So yeah, really, really nice. I think she's going to come out looking really, really nice. I love her. So yeah. And she's got a bit of a sparkle to her. And the stickiness, very, look at this, very nice and sticky. I left it right off. <laughs> oh, give my finger back, please. Thank you. So yeah. Really, really nice time of painting. And like I said, I'll make sure that I give you the prices um, in my description. So my apologies for not having them ahead of time. Alright, this one is just a 30 by 30. And what is this one? I don't remember what this one is, and I can't really tell by the thumbnail. Oh! So this one is um, the Statue of Liberty, and I'm not sure how this is even going to turn out. When I first saw it, that was really cute. It's got 26 colors, and it does have all the guided circles in there. So if you don't like guided circles, this one has it. <laughs> um, but it is 1 through 8, and then C down to W. Oh no, wait, sorry. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But then it has some letters, and then it has small letters, and then it has some symbols in it as well. So there's a mixture. But they did try to put it in some kind of order. Um, but yeah, so there it is. And like I said, it's just, you can see the Statue of Liberty. There are American flags flying in the background uh, and a lighthouse there. So, like I said, I'm not sure how this one will turn out, but I just really love the picture. And so, yeah. Yeah, I think I bought this for, like, Independence Day. Not in, oh, for Memorial Day, I think. Um, I saw, saw it for that, and I, and I think I got it then, but yeah. Very, very sparkly canvas, though. And very clear drill fill, really. But you can see the little guided circles there. Um, my camera doesn't want to focus, so my apologies, guys. So, yeah. Like I said, I'm not exactly sure how, how it's going to turn out. But you can see the ends there. So. So, yeah. I mean, it is a cute little picture, though. Um, I think I, w I would have... I think this picture here, or this painting here, would have been better in probably a 50 by 50. Uh, that's usually the size I go for, either or a 40 by 40. But we will see. I mean, it's beautiful. It's absolutely gorgeous. So. And then, these ones didn't even come enough. 
wrapped up or anything. So it is on a long train. <laughs> but yeah, they didn't even wrap them up there. So there's some of the colors there. But yeah, and these drills do look like they have quite a bit of static in them. But I mean, they, overall though, the diamonds look nice. They do look really, really nice. I got two guys. I mean, I can go through these. So, I mean, they're open anyway, so. <laughs> Lots of blues, dark blues. Light blues. So, I mean, there are sparkles on these diamonds. I love this white. I don't know if they were white. And so, yeah. But yeah, they didn't even come wrapped up in a, you know, it just put in there, so. so. those are the diamonds for this little painting. Oh, and how's the stick on this, you say? Nice and sticky. Very nice and sticky. And then it comes with your little, uh, this one's even smaller. Look smaller. Hold on. Let me see something. It is. Oh no. Yeah. It's it fits inside the other boat very easily. So, but this this one is a bit more sturdy. It has higher sides. It's not really slanted. It can the sides go up and down. So this tray would probably be pretty good. Um, even though it's small, it would still be good. And then you get your pen and you get your wax. So it's a bit, a lot more sturdier than these ones that are just, you can bend like nothing. And see this one is a little bit more sturdy. So yeah. Anyway, so that's the second one. And then my third one is another 40 by 40. And this one just comes again with your little bit of a flimsy boat, but your wax and your pen, so it comes with that. This one does come kitted up already, so yay! And this one, oh, I have to roll her the other way. Oh, a nice sparkly canvas. This one has 24 colors, and it is 1 through 9 and A through O. So it's Tita approved. So look at her. Isn't she just gorgeous? So this is Elsa. She's got a braid. Uh, so yeah. I just thought she was so pretty. And I know my granddaughter will love her, so... Really, really nice. Really nice gel fill there, too. Very nice and clear. So I think everything is going to turn out really nice on her. I think her eyes are going to turn out. Um, yeah, I think everything is going to turn out. Even her hand. And, I mean, it's basically just her, right? So... I mean, her, the background's not too busy or anything. And it is a 40 by 40. And I like this size, so. Okay, this is a nice size for a diamond painting. And then here are the colors. So it does have a number here. I usually check to make sure that the numbers are on these, these bags, especially on these kind of uh, bags. Because I have had some that have nothing on like with nothing labeled so yeah <clears throat> but really nice let's do it this way the really really nice colors in there so yeah love the yellows and I love the blues and it got your pinks and so it's all all kitted up ready to go Perfect. 
And we'll check the stickiness of this one, which I'm sure is fine. Oh yeah, nice and sticky. Look at that. You can easily lift it up. So, little Miss Elsa. Now, I was talking to someone the other day and, and they were telling me some things and I said, like, you know, you just gotta let it go. Just like Elsa, let it go. Just let it go. <laughs> My granddaughter sang that song over and over and over again. She just had it memorized. It's so cute. And last but not least, I have a little, I think this one's a 30 by 30, but we will see. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Yes, 30 by 30. And I just thought it was so adorable. My, my table's getting so full. <laughs> um, but it does come, oh, so this one too comes with a bit of a better boat. Um, so they're, I think they're changing their, their uh, trays here. And I mean, it is smaller than the other green one, but it's a lot more sturdier. So it comes with your piece of wax and it comes with a pen. Like I said, that's all you need. And these are the colors. If you can see that or not. Not really, can you? Hmm. But anyway, so these are the colors. It's hard to show a 30 by 30 color, so. But maybe better this way. So it's got, of course, some oranges and browns. And they're basically fall colors, I'm going to say, in this one. But yeah, you can kind of see them in there. This is a cute little one. Isn't it just adorable? Just reminded me of my Ollie. And so yeah, really, really cute. <laughs> oh, so cute. Look at the little puppy. I just love little puppies. Uh, this one has 18 colors and it is all letters and they're all alphabetical. Nice. Very, very nice. And again, it's just a little 30 by 30 and probably wouldn't take very long to do. There's a lot of color blocking in here. And so, yeah, but I just thought he was adorable. And like I said, just remind him of my little Ollie. <laughs> kind of got my pixie face though too when she's got her hair longer on her face. Just got her um, shave for the summer, so, oops. But really, really cute. So yeah, so those are my diamond paintings. Like I said, I'll have the I'll have them linked in my description for you if they're as long as they're still available. Um, if they are sold out, I'll make sure that I put notification on. And if I do get notified, I will for sure let you know when it comes back. Um, lately, I haven't been getting those notifications, so I'm not sure what's happening with Timo uh, with their notifications. But every once in a while, I'll say, "Oh, a picture is back," but. Um, I'm not even sure how long ago it was that uh, <laughs> that they were, um, or either that or maybe another seller is selling them. That could be too, because uh, that happens a lot where more than one seller will be selling the same diamond painting. Maybe a different size, but the uh, pictures are the same. But anyways, guys, that's it. That's all I have to show for you for today. I hope everyone's having a wonderful day. Um, so I got my little pixie girl here. Uh, we did get a call back from the surgeon and he's going to do a consultation with us. And um, it looks like she's going to have to have a knee replacement done. And he says it's going to be about $5,000. <laughs> so yeah. Um, I said that will put a little uh, pinch into our savings. But hey, she's worth it, aren't you? So we, we have to have that consultation done with, the, like I said, with the doctor to see. But uh, please just keep praying for her and I know that uh, we will do what's needed for our little pixie girl here, won't we? The mama's girl. She's not really limping on her, on her leg at all. Um, 
We, since we've been giving her that medicine that the vet gave us, she's been doing really, really good. Every once in a while, when she's rough playing with her brother, and we try to keep them separated, but it happens. Uh, she'll let out a little whimper and kind of uh, raise up her leg a little bit. But uh, so obviously, she didn't just dislocate her knee. It sounds like she's going to need a whole knee re knee replacement. So she must have banged it up pretty good there. Um, like I said, I th still think it stems from when she was like four months old and uh, jumping off the couch there and trying to go for a toy and she really hurt her leg. And that's what I think uh, it started from back then already. So, But anyways guys, we will take care of her. She is my baby and yes, we will take care of her. It doesn't matter the cost. We will, we will get the money somehow. We will get her all fixed up and she will be good as new. But, uh, but anyway, just wanted to update you on our, my little pixie girl there. And uh, so from my home to yours, have a beautiful, beautiful day. Um, stay indoors where it's nice and cool. As I could do, you know, like I said, there's a heat wave. If it's storming outside, stay indoors. Keep safe. Uh, make sure you're weather aware. So there's lots of channels out there that you can watch. Um, to keep you updated if you're if you do have really really bad storms in your area so but with that being said i just love you guys all and i just care for you all and as always god's richest blessings see you on the next one